Hey, what's up everybody? My name is TrophyNet and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn. Um, today I'd like to help out a few people in the game because uh, we're uh, piling up the final side quests and uh, a while back when we first got, got to uh, Sunfall we found a few refugees outside of the city and one of them needed help with a sick young Karja refugee and uh, we're gonna try and find a healer in this uh, well, I, I'm almost eager to call this uh, a city, but it's a pretty big structure over here. In between the cliffs, because there's more up there. That's Kestrel's Perch, and this is Blazon Arch. So, uh, yeah, where is this healer that can help out the uh, young refugee we're trying to help? This looks actually pretty cool. Kind of like an oasis, uh, a desert city. Much like uh, Sunfall itself, but this looks... Because of its location, it's actually pretty cool looking. And the, the rest of the buildings, it's really well protected as well. Uh, well, aside for uh, a tsunami or something like that. Hello, Galif. Are you Galif, the healer? I had planned to spend the day gazing at the lands of my exile and feeling sorry for myself. But you're not from Sunfall, so this could be interesting. I came from the tenth city there. There's a sick girl. Her brother told me about you. The answer is no. Okay, then. No, I can't spare the medicine, nor my time to administer it. My resources are already spread thin. Thin as the soiled cloths I have to use for dressings. Your um, clothes look really good. So I don't think you're... You've been spending that much time in exile yet. Why won't you help? Look at it from my perspective. What meager goods I can get must be smuggled in. That's expensive. The behemoth's share goes to the military. Of course, there are the demands of the Citadel. Helis's kestrels are so prone to sticky ends. What's left, that's for the nobles, who can pay well for my services. Look at it from my perspective. A little girl is sick. So you're just a greedy I think bastard. We're calling to each other across an ideological impasse. I love how he said the behemoths share instead of the lions share, because they don't even know what a lion is. Although that begs the question if they would ever know that proverb. But uh, what's stopping me from just making you do it? I'd have to cause a situation. And you wouldn't harm the only healer disgraced enough to work for the Shadow Karja, would you? Well, we've only just met, but yes, it's tempting. <laughs> take it up with the Citadel. They decide who lives and dies. Nothing you can do would compare to my punishment if I use the last of my stock on a tent girl. Okay, then. <sighs> You're kind of an ass healer. An ass healer. There's no cure for a conscience, but in this line of work, I've built up an immunity to it. And yet, if you that feel was a creepy so smile. strongly about this one girl, perhaps we can make a deal. My charity for a Thunderjaw heart. Question is, not how charity works. do I have one already? It is how deals work. You'd settle my debts for a while. Those parts aren't exactly easy to come by. I think I already have them. happens, a thunder jaw prowls the Valley of Omens, north and west of here. I know it well because they expect me to put its victims back together. Runaways, mostly. If I do this, it's not for you. Oh, I'm not expecting you to do it at all. But I'll be heading back to the Citadel later. Um... You know what? I think I actually have a thunder jaw heart, although... Apparently I need this specific... I don't have the part yet. Your thunder jaws oh, to the okay. north and west of here, you said? In the Valley of Omens. Really, as a healer, I should advise against this undertaking. Yeah, because you're probably really but concerned with me. you give me the aid I need. No. Okay then. So I thought I had a thunder jaw heart, but I did clean out my inventory a while back, so... It's actually really, yeah, it's, I just cleared out every heart because I didn't think I ever needed any one of them. As well, I have all the weapons, I have all the upgrades, I didn't think I needed Thunderjaw heart anymore. So, uh, give me a second, then we'll kill that thing. 
The Valley of Omens. I'm wondering, yeah, okay, so this seems to be the right spot. So let's take a look around. Where is this Thunderjaw? This has to be the place. The Thunderjaw shouldn't be hard to find. No, indeed, it shouldn't be. Oh, there it is. Get off. Okay. So I've been here already because I uh, cleared out all the metal flowers. There was one over here. No, no, you can't see me. I'm behind the rocks. I'm just gonna try and get the drop on it a bit. Maybe even a bit of resources. Because there isn't any high grass here, so I can't even try to override it. I'm just gonna try and get what I need here. Oh, he's far away. That doesn't mean anything with a thunder job, but. Hmm. That thing is huge. And built to fight. There we go. There we go. Again. go I'm looking for yeah there it is where is it where is it where is it there it is and this clone shoot go taking care of most of the damage then let's take oh that was something I didn't expect oh can I actually override this thing oh snap There we go. Oh my god, I never done this before. Because I really wanted to do that just once. Look at this. That is my, uh, oh, that disappeared. My very own tender jaw. That I'm gonna have to put down. But it is really cool. Is it shaking its head? What the hell is it doing? That was weird. So three arrows. And then... Oh! There we go. Ooh, didn't expect that one. Come on. Dodge out of the way. There we go. Filing up the 100 damage per shot.
Yeah, it's going down. There we go. Get a tender jaw heart. Thank you very Looking much. Me. So I do. I can't carry the well, the rest of the parts anymore. But I don't care. I love it. Ooh, that is a horrifying sight. There we go. My tender jaw corpse. So yeah, we got the tender jaw heart, and now let's get back to Gavid. And uh, get that bastard of a healer to uh, save that little girl. So see you guys back there in a second. So there we go. I changed outfit because uh, of course we need to be uh, wearing the uh, Shadow Karja outfit to be walking around in here. So hello, Galiv. I have your machine part. A deal's a deal. See to the girl and it's yours. On my oath. But tell me, if this girl survives, what do you suppose is her future? Does that matter? It's better than not having a future at all. There we go. What a charming notion. Come, come, let's be quick about this. Kindness doesn't keep well in the heat. You are such a big asshole. Let's talk to our boss again to see if uh, the healer actually did what he uh, promised. Uh, where? Ah, over there. Hello, our boss. Hello. It's you. Hello again. He I looks creepy as hell. Sister. How did you... What did we do to deserve... No, wait. I don't even want to ask. In case a shadow passes over and it's gone. Smart boy. She'll have his full attention. Won't she? Once I'm freed of other distractions, yes. Talking about us, of course. So there we go. Completed healer's oath. That was uh, an interesting little side quest. We have time for one more, so I am going to do the quests we started in the Nora lands, where uh, there was a young man also wounded, so we're getting into the healer territory here. And we needed to find some uh, herbs on the on the trail, so uh, give me a second and we'll head back to where it all began. So the brave trail, so uh, trail. there we go. Should be a cache of dream wheel up there. If I... How the hell do I get up there? Do I just use that rope or... I think I do. So these were the tests that we uh, completed when we started the game. Where we uh, succeeded and became brave but everybody got killed on that uh, test at the end there. By Helis' uh, Shadow Karja army. But uh, right now we're, we live in a bit more... Happy times, Jesus. Aloy, jump on the rope, thank you. So there we go, the first cache of Dream Willow. Don't know why she did that. There we go. No Dream Willow. Ooh. Just a few shards. That is bad. Let's check out the next one, and hopefully there will be some Dream Willow over there, because otherwise we're gonna have a bit of a problem. So I'm making my way through the hunting grounds and there should be, yeah, up there again, there should be another cache right be next cache to that tree. That brave trail. So these are obviously not the brave trails we did when we uh, started the game, but oh, okay. So over here, and then from over here, let's just drop down. I think I bypassed a bit of the trail, but I don't care. There we go. Metal shards. Strange. Looks like someone swapped all the dream below in these caches for shards. Talk to Fia. No yeah, dream indeed. In caches. Fia wants to know. So, uh, I'm gonna make my way back to Fia and see if we can find dream willow in another way so see you guys back at fia in a second so back at mother's rise i think she was over here behind me yeah over here hello fia we have some bad news you're back yeah we are i've already been to those stashes all i found was a few shards that's strange who would have taken the dream willow it's possible that john has gathered more you could ask him if you're willing to make the journey. I'll well, you are making me run Thanks all so over the place, oh, all over the way. place, all over Goodbye. the place. I can't talk again. Jun, 
Who the hell is Jun? Because everybody seems to think I, I know the guy, but... See you guys right over there, apparently. Find Jun. This is gonna take a while, so give me a second. But of course, you guys don't need to sit through the entire journey, but we're getting close, and the mountains are getting uh, quite a bit snowier. And I think I'm gonna have to leave my mount here. Get off, Eloy. Get off, thank you. Okay, the strider w went face first into the wall. Another campfire I haven't discovered yet, so... I do keep getting around new places I haven't been yet. This is actually in the starting area still, so... We could have discovered this as soon as uh, we started the game, but we didn't. Trying to always be as thorough as possible. Where the hell is that coming from? Hello? There's even a house here. How the hell did you lock yourself in? Yeah, yeah. Investigate the lodge. Unblock the door. Isn't this the door? Okay, there's two doors. Both of the doors are blocked then. Is someone there? Yeah, we are. Why is this blocked with that spear? And how would you oh, open that in that way? I thought I'd never be free. What happened? A gang of outcasts, that's what. They burst in, stole my dream willow and left me to die. Okay. A gang of outcasts? Yes, a gang. The door crashed open. I didn't stand a chance. They grabbed my dream willow and left me for dead. They expected you to just die in your own house. I suspect you have a bit of supplies here, Why so... Why would outcasts steal your dream willow? Wasn't that big of a risk? Why? Because it's the most valuable herb I gather, of course. Miserable thieves. They took nothing else? No. Mark my words. They have struck a deal with outsiders. It's shards they're after, and they'll kill to get it. Okay, where can I find these guys? Which way did the outcasts go? Or girls. Up the mountain, I think. You might catch them if you hurry. Whatever you do, don't let their shabby looks fool you. They'll kill you as soon as look at you. This man is oh, very angry. I need to catch my breath. Yeah, you could stop talking for a start. Why did she say it like that? It sounded like she's already suspecting him the or something. must have left tracks. My focus should pick them up. Shards gambling box. Stuff. Outside his door. Tracks. Well, someone left here recently, and they were in a hurry. Okay. Let's follow the tracks. Conveniently following the path, of course. Hurry. Help me up! I might regret this. No, I won't regret this. Got it! There we go. Okay. He's kicking my ass. Jesus. Because there are blaze canisters underneath his belly. And he doesn't like fire at all. There we go. And there we go. Taken care of like a quick shot. Hello, you thief. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Talk to this man. You have our thanks. If the gratitude of outcasts means anything to you. It does. You not only save us, but speak to us. The matriarchs cast me out at birth. The laws of the Nora don't mean much to me. And you're that girl whose mother never claimed her. But an outcast no longer. No. A seeker, in fact. Looking for Dream Willow. Actually, the hmm. anointed. That could be a problem. Um... Why? Why did you take the Dream Willow? Because we have wounded. Why else would we take it? Something terrible has happened to the tribe. The braves offer no protection. The machines are angry and bandits infest the sacred land and prey upon us. 
No. Why else would outcasts break custom and band together, but that we have no choice? All the bandits Even are so, dead. We did not steal. We left shards in the stashes and tried to pay John. But of course he would not speak to us. Okay, that's weird. John said you roughed him up. He was too busy cringing to know what happened. The man's a coward. We made sure not to hurt him, not that he seemed to notice. Okay, and why were he cast out? What crimes did you and the others commit? I beat a man who stole my kill. It was my wrong. The others stole, broke custom, or trespassed among the bones of the metal world. No murderers here, if that's what you're asking. Okay, can you get me a bit of Dream Willow then? There are others who need Dream Willow. You can't have all of it. You asking or demanding? Talking. One person to another. I see. Perhaps we have more than we need. After everything that happened, we were afraid. We took all we could find. Here, I'll keep a portion, but the rest... May it find its way to those who need it. Okay, thank you. In the meantime, you may want to go back to Mother's heart. Things have changed there a bit. Tell them I sent you. Okay, so now they do realize... Welcome. That's weird. This must have changed quite a lot. All right. We'll consider it. Good luck. That's Stay actually really safe. cool that the game realizes that we're past the point that the Nora wouldn't accept Outcasts anymore. So uh, I'm gonna head back to Jun and give him uh, the Dream Willow, well, part of it. I keep one bit for me so I can give that to Fia. I can actually finish up the quest over here, it seems. So Jun's hut, I wonder what he has to say about all of this. If he realizes that they maybe didn't attack him. Here's the Dream Willow. Take it to Fia and Mother's Rise. There are wounded braves there who need it badly. Okay, that's weird I that will. we don't do that. But what became of the outcasts? Did those wretches pay for their crimes? Ganging up together, speaking to each other, and to us. I hope you showed them no mercy. You don't know who I am, do you? Should no, he I? doesn't. I was raised as an outcast in the mountains above Mother's heart. The motherless girl. If I'd known, I never would have spoken to you. Okay then, an outcast helped you, remember? How about I put you in your place or time to look in the mirror? It's funny how you hate outcasts so much, Jen. Living out here all alone, you're practically one yourself. I happily keep my own company. Yeah, I wonder you, why. Since I don't exactly see anyone beating down the door to spend time with you. Except outcasts in need of Dream Willow, that is. I'm done here. Make sure that Fia gets that Dream Willow. Or I'll be back. I'll be back. Yeah, insult to injury completed. Because that Jun character was a real... Well, straight class a-hole. So yeah, that's uh, two more side quests done. And I believe we're... Uh, yeah, we're really closing this series down. I think I'm going to do one more episode uh, with a side quest. And then the final trophy I still need. So... Uh, I'm going to take a little break, so thank you guys enormously for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to like it right here on YouTube. And, uh, well, I hope to see you guys back in the final episode next time. Goodbye.